Okay, so hi everyone, my name is Sam. I'm going to talk to you today about co-op. As you all know, you are going to take six internships, totaling over two years of work experience. The world is your oyster if you choose Waterloo. Specifically, we have a job portal with over thousands of jobs from hundreds of companies, from hundreds of industries, with hundreds of roles. But specifically, I'm going to talk to you today about why management engineering specifically will launch your career. So as you all know, as Curtis said, we are super data-driven as management engineers. So I'm going to just dive deep into some of the LinkedIn results from our postgraduates, so our management alumni. You'll see here that the top employers, um, there's a wide distribution of industries. You've got your consulting, you've got Deloitte, number one, and number six, Accenture. you got manufacturing, so PepsiCo and Toyota. Um, you got your big tech companies like Microsoft and Amazon, and you've got banking, so financial industries like RBC and Manulife. So you're really not put into this cookie cutter, you're only set up for one industry. There's so many things that you could do. <laughs> okay, so we're going to just dive into the most common job titles. Um, it matches up pretty well with the types of industries that you saw on the previous slide. So number one, consultant. Many of our management engineering alumni um, are working at Deloitte as consultants or PWC. You have your business analysts. These are very data-driven roles. Their main role is to provide a lot of graphs, a lot of actionable insights to provide to executives in many companies. Um, and you have your product manager, which is also within the information systems pathway of management engineering. Um, as you can see, on the more OR side, you have supply chain analyst and manufacturing engineer, so number six and number nine. Okay. So